Ademus is a series of vocalized style albums by Welsh composer Carl Jenkins. It is also the title of the opening track called Ademus on the first album in the series, Songs of Sanctuary. Concept Each Ademus album is a collection of song length pieces featuring harmonized vocal melody against an orchestra background. There are no lyrics as such, instead, the vocalists sing syllables and words invented by Jenkins. However, rather than creating musical interest from patterns of phonemes, the language of Ademus is carefully stylized so as not to distract the listener's attention from the pitch and timbre of the voice. Syllables rarely end in consonants, for example. In this respect it is similar to Japanese in several other languages. The core concept of Ademus is that the voice should be allowed to function as nothing more than an instrument, an approach that was a trend in some New Age and world music choral writing in the mid to late 1990s, or Dog Era, a symphonic suite by French composer Apermelchen Peruchin. The word Ademus itself resembles the Latin word Ademus meaning let us approach, or, is sometimes regarded as the future tense of the same verb, meaning we will approach, or we will take possession. Jenkins has said he was unaware of this. Perhaps even more appropriately, the song title also resembles two forms of the Latin verb odia, that is audimus and audiamus. Instrumentation and performers, scoring for songs of sanctuary, recorder, eight percussion, four tom-toms, congas, cymbals, claves, floor tom, bass drum, mark tree, bass bell in C, cabasa, wood block, triangle, strings, scoring for cantata mundi, two flutes, two oboes, two clarinets, two bassoons, six horns, three trumpets, four trombones, tuba, timpani, claves, cowbell, gar one quarter iro, two kabakas, triangle, shinkan, Egyptian tabla, duola, tom tom, cymbals, shekir, xylophone, glockenspiel, bass marimba, bongos, rec, hud pot, tablas, sticks, pandero, timbales, cerdo, bass drum, tamtam, suspended cymbals, tambourine, recorder, strings, scoring for dances of time, seven singers, two flutes, two oboes, two clarinets, two bassoons, six horns, three trumpets, four trombones, tuba, timpani, eight percussionists, bass drum, bongos, cowbell, shekir, trocola, cymbals, claves, congas, kabaka, castanets, tholak, gar one quarter iro, five low drums, low shakir, marimba, rainmaker, rec, snare drum, shaker, cerdo, tom tom, tabla, tambourine, tambourine, triangle, udo, wood block, xylophone, recorder, strings, scoring for the eternal knot, recorder, accordion, percussion, harp, strings, scoring for vocalize, for voices and orchestra, session singer Miriam Stockley performed the vocal parts on the first four albums. Stockley was described by Jenkins as central to the Ademus project due to her range and intonation. However, she was not re-engaged for vocalize. Additional vocals were provided by Mary Carew on All But Dances of Time, which saw the introduction of the Finnish Adema singers. Extra vocals and the chorus effects were created by overdubbing multitracked recordings of the singers and varying the speed of the tape. The Songs of Sanctuary Orchestra consisted of a string section augmented by various ethnic percussion instruments, with occasional further additions such as bells, a recorder and a kna. Mike Ratledge, with whom Jenkins has played in Soft Machine, contributed to the first album as well. Jenkins added brass and woodwind for Cantata Mundi, and continued to add more diverse instruments such as acoustic guitar on later albums. From Songs of Sanctuary to Dances of Time, the London Philharmonic Orchestra was used. Jenkins later formed his own Ademus Orchestra to perform on the Eternal Knot recordings, returning to the London Philharmonic for vocalize. Equals Singers equals, Miriam Stockley, Pidjo Outama Currency Key, Mavi Hilchun, Anna Mari Car Currency Ha Currency Ra Currency, Meja Rajala, Za Currency Darisanin, Hani Yika Sitanen, Mia Simonanin, Nina Tapio, Yika Taimanen. Albums. Equals Studio Albums equals, Ademus, Songs of Sanctuary, Ademus 2, 
Cantata Mundi Adimus 3, Dances of Time, Adimus 4, The Eternal Knot, Adimus V, Vocalize, Adimus, Colors. Equals Special Albums Equals, The Journey, The Best of Adimus, Adimus Live, Adimus New Best in Live, The Essential Adimus. Musical Style, The Musical Language of Adimus draws heavily on classical and world music. Jenkins follows conventions of tonality up to a point a euro his harmony is derived from gospel and African music, decorated with functional dissonances such as suspensions and with greater freedom of movement between loosely related key areas. He avoids the most common time signatures, such as two quarters, three quarters and four slash four, with a slow three halves being very characteristic along with six slash eight, nine slash eight and even five slash eight. Free time is also prominent, in this as well as the majority of New Age projects. The percussion section, when used prominently, typically gives the pieces an upbeat, tribal-like rhythm. The sound of Adimus is generally identified with New Age or Celtic music. The Eternal Knot is an explicitly Celtic-themed album that formed the soundtrack for the S4C documentary The Celts. Audience, Songs of Sanctuary was a commercial success topping classical album charts. Though none of its successors has achieved the same critical acclaim, Adimus acquired a cult following and maintained a place in mainstream consciousness through its use in TV commercials, in particular the track Adimus in a Delta Airlines commercial and Cantilma, from Cantata Mundi, in a Cheltenham and Gloucester commercial. Adimus was also the eighth feature track of the original 1997 Pure Moods album. It was used at the beginning and end of James Brandon's magic show Imagine, which played at the Luxor Hotel in Las Vegas in the late 1990s, and is currently used as the soundtrack behind the Kubla Khan Pillar show at the end of the Rotunda Cave Tour in Karchna Cavern State Park in Arizona. Additionally, Adimus was used in the trailer to the Invisible Children's documentary film and featured in the titles of the 1996 BBC children's series Testament, The Bible in Animation. That same year, it was used in the Baywatch episode Beauty and the Beast. Tintinabulum was sampled in Solestone's 1999 Ibiza Trancy Anthem Seven Cities. References External links, Adimus on MySpace, Adimus on Las FM.